Hi friends, I'm Dhruv Varoda. Thanks for watching. So today I'm going to tell you how you're going to choose your aircraft for building your fixed wing UAV with a Pixar Cube. So uh, I have these two models with me. This is a Ranger X by Volantex RC and this one is FX61 by Zeta Science Gonjao. So if you are a beginner, please listen to me carefully and in case you are having some good experience in flying RC planes, you can totally ignore this video and go ahead with the exact uh, uh, airframe that you are comfortable using. So in this, what I would recommend is go for a basic four channel plane, which means it has ailerons, it has a rudder and it has an elevator. That's it. Do not go for something like this if you are a beginner because in this you have something called elevon mixing and you do not have a rudder. So it does become kind of complicated sometimes for people who are new to uh, something like building a UAV uh, using a Pixar. Another reason I want to go ahead with this is that it has ample amount of space inside the fuselage. This one has much less space under the canopy and it does become tough. For beginners again, if you go for a flying wing, uh, another thing that uh, sometimes people are worried about is that when you're hand launching, what happens is you're worried that your hand might get cut with the propeller because you know it is actually at a very high RPM since it has to take off and get a proper lift so that it can you know move on and normally a lot of people they like to actually uh, switch on the throttle go up full throttle and then launch so it does become kind of risky i have seen people cutting their hand with such uh, high speed propellers i would not recommend if you are a beginner to go ahead with something like a flying wing so another reason why I want to use this Ranger X airframe is that it has a better wingspan. It's about 2000 mm and it does glide well. So you are able to fly it much slower, uh, especially when you are uh, auto tuning or maybe even setting up rest of the parameters. Uh, I'm going to give you more details on the components that you're going to use for building your fixed wing UAV with the Pixar Cube in my next video. Stay tuned, share and subscribe as much as you can. Take care, happy flying.